Michael, a 3-2 defeat MK Dons today. What's your immediate take on that? We were poor today. Um, flat, no tempo, moved the ball too slowly, give away poor goals. And we've got to learn the dark arts of, of football. You know, that you see their players putting their arms, getting across their, their bodies across, making it hard for ever strikers. And then we let players run, run straight through. So I'm really disappointed. Um, turned down, crossing ch chances, times to put the ball in the box where I'd say we were overplaying today um, and, it, and it was just too slow. Three changes from Gillingham, of course, Clates, Rush and Kintella came in today. How do you assess their return? Look, it's, you know, we've, we've had to try and freshen it up a little bit. Obviously, Tom Brewitt is out with the concussion protocol. Hopefully, you know, he's been ever present um, and hopefully he'll be back on the weekend. Dan Kemp, we missed. Um, you know, he's been a big part of us and been ever present as well. So, um, yeah, it's, um, you know, it's back against the wall time at the minute, you know, with, with what we got. But, um, look, we'll dust ourselves down and, and look forward to FA Cup game now. Just a quick note on Tom Clayton, of course, his first start today since injury. You know, great to see him back out there from the start. Yeah, um, obviously, you know, it's, we, we tried to surprise him today. Um, but we were just too flat. We were too he hesitant, uh, too slow. Um, and we really lacked the urgency that we did have on Tuesday night, even though we lost the game. You know, um, put it this you know, we've lost 3 2 today, so by the odd goal. But we were a lot better Tuesday than, than we were today. And, you know, I, you know look, we'll have, a, we'll have a, a tough week. We'll have a week there we, where we've got to get, get them back up and, um, and raise their confidence again. Player on availability saw some academy players brought into the first team, so a learning experience for them today. It is a learning experience, and look, they're on the bench. We've had a few, you know, we, we, we've had a few injuries, um, you know, and, and at the minute, that's you know, we're working with with what we got. But it's key to give them those, the, you know, those young players' experience, and hopefully, it bears f fruit in the in the future. But um, look, I felt. I thought we were really flat today, and it was it was disappointing for for that group of supporters who come with us today because it's over 2,200. We, you know, we, I say we had a 20, 25 minute spell second half where we got back in where we we were much better. It looked like only one team was going to win it then, and then again we go and concede a, a poor goal from our point of view. You touched on it there, you know, a brief spell where we looked to kick on from there. What was the message at half time? Well, the message at half time was you best start pressing and start raising it. Um, you know, we. We had triggers in the first half, and you know when when you first trigger, don't don't trigger the press. Um, it's difficult for anybody else to do it then. So they were um, they were. I, I say we we were disappointed today. We win together, we lose together, and um, look, it's it's not a, a blaming culture. It's a togetherness, and uh, we've got to dust ourselves down. Of course, the two goals delivered positives on both ends. Obviously, Jake Young back on the score sheet and a goal for mistake. Please late on today. Yeah. Um, but again, it was too little, too late. Like I said, Jake come on and made a positive impact, um, you know, which he, admittedly he, he hasn't he hasn't done as much of lately. So I'm pleased for him. You know, hopefully that's a weight off his mind in terms of double figures. So um, yeah, look, we, we just got to look forward now to the to the uh, FA Cup game. You touched on that mentality, obviously sticking together, winning together, losing together. How important is that mentality as we look to kick on now? It's important because it's only us in there who can change it. Well, at least until January. So we've got to stick together, not feel sorry for ourselves, and and, and dust ourselves down and go again and, and get these fans on the edge of their seats again. It's probably the, the only one we haven't this season. I'll I'll, I'll be I'll be honest, but um, I don't want many more of them.